Okay, just got out of the Oppenheimer screening. Three hours, no fucking AC. Back sweating, no ice, by the way. <laughs> that That's beside the point, right? As far as the uh, review of the film. I say to you, don't believe the hype. I enjoyed the film. I think it's a rare film involving political intrigue, great performances, Robert Downey Jr., Matt Damon, others uh, as well. Top-notch acting, great directing, but man, fucking too long. And I'm into political intrigue. I love politics. Something intellectually stimulating and reverberating my, my brain, you know, making my brain think. Love it. Uh, but too fucking long, man. Who wants to see a movie about uh, the atomic bomb? And I, I mean, I get it, the whole thing. He's uh, deemed a communist. His wife had a... Okay, I'm blowing it for you now. I don't give a fuck. Uh, his wife had, was a part of the... You know, held a uh, communist party card 17 years prior uh but he had communist leanings so you know the government doesn't take lightly to that shit especially if you're developing a nuclear bomb they deemed him you know a proud american but um couldn't renew his clearance ultimately uh, yeah and i just blew the movie for you but uh that information has been out for a long time so so be it but a great performance by the lead actor cillian murphy right that's his name Great performance by him. I'm sure he'll get nominated. But we'll see what else is coming out this year. You know, you can't, you can't say he's going to win it for sure. I mean, I've seen some good performances this year as well. So overall, you know what I'd say? It's like, and I saw it in 70 millimeters, so the image is good. But I had the fucking shittiest seat because, you know, I waited for the last minute to see this movie. And uh, I'd say just wait till it comes out on streaming. I, again... Don't believe the hype, overrated, mm, seven out of 10, you know? But uh, it's a long stretch, three hours. I'm like, okay, come on, man, come on. And I, by the way, I didn't mind the movement of time shifts, you know, going back in time. That actually worked for me, kind of to clarify the story. So I'd say wait until it comes out on streaming.